Hi guys, thank you very much Savannah for that. So uh, MBBS is a program that a lot of students, a lot of you guys want to study and it's very popular for you to study in China. And I'm going to share some more about the options to study MBBS in different countries and regions around the world. So uh, firstly, I want to introduce that recently there's been a huge increase in demand for doctors all around the world, uh, partly because of the coronavirus situation. Uh, but generally, there's a huge need for doctors. So there's a massive need and a huge demand. And a lot of students are looking to become doctors. Uh, but unfortunately, there are limited options. And recently, there are even less options available. Uh, due to Russia and Ukraine, actually, it's very difficult to study in, in those places. And China currently is not allowing students to go to China to study MBBS. So a lot of students are having challenges to study in these places uh, because if you're studying medicine you really need to go to the to the place to the country so that you can do practical work experience and um, so because there's not as many options and there's huge demand there's a lot more competition for students who are trying to do to, to become doctors all around the world so this is a huge problem so we're trying to help you guys and actually we're going to introduce some other destinations that you can study at all around the world and some of them are at the same or similar price to China. Some of them are even cheaper than China. And there are lots of amazing destinations that you can study around the world. So I'm going to introduce some of them today. So I'm going to introduce the uh, destinations that are cheaper or the same as China. And then I'm going to introduce some that are more expensive than China. And then I'm going to uh, introduce some that are uh, more expensive, like even more expensive. So, Let's start with China. So we have a lot of experience helping international students study MBBS in China. So there are 45 medical schools in China that do MBBS in English. And so there's lots of students from all over the world who come to China to study in, uh, in, uh, to come to China to study medicine and MBBS. Uh, this is especially for Indian and Pakistani students, but also from Africa and all over Asia and uh, many other countries around the world. So these are some of the popular universities and medical schools in China, such as Shantou University Medical College, uh, Dalian Medical University, Jiangsu, Medical, Jiangsu University and uh, Wuhan University. And you can see all of the 45 on the China Admissions website. And we also have a lot more content about how you can study MBBS in China. And the average price for studying MBBS in China is about 30,000 RMB. Uh, which is about five or six thousand US dollars per year, and that doesn't—that's only the tuition, so it doesn't include the living expenses as well. Uh, so the living expenses in China could be about eight thousand uh, US dollars per year, or between uh, five thousand to eight thousand US dollars per year. It depends. A lot of it depends on where you're studying. If you're studying in a big city, or if you're studying in a smaller city, the prices, the living expense is going to be a lot less. So this is another destination that a lot of students are interested in, and that is uh, Philippines. And the system in Philippines is not strictly called MBBS. It's similar to the American system where it's the BS and the MD. Uh, so Philippines is, actually, is recognized all around the world for having high quality recognized uh, medical programs. And so it's very good to study Philippines and uh, study medicine in the Philippines. Uh, the climate is very attractive to live in and the, the, there is a low cost of living compared to uh, China and also other countries. So the average uh, tuition fee at uh, AMA University, which is a medical school in the Philippines, is 4,200 US dollars per year. And you can also see uh, some of the other options in the Philippines on the Global Emissions website. So we have uh, at the moment, we have about 50 of the lowest price MBBS programs on global admissions. So if you're interested in that, you can check it out. So Kyrgyzstan is also another low cost destination. And this is, so the program is six years. And you can see some of the programs here, like the International School of Medicine and the International University of Kyrgyzstan and Asian Medical Institute. So they can be from 3,000 US dollars up to 7,600 US dollars per year. So Kazakhstan is another popular destination and it's actually got a similar price to Philippines and Kyrgyzstan. And you can see some of the programs here uh, 
such as the Karaganda State Medical University. And you can also see uh, Cernay State Medical University and some of the other ones there. And there's a little bit of variation in the price, uh, but you can definitely find some low, lower cost programs in these countries. Uh, one thing that you need to be aware of is the language, and I'll just dis discuss more about that later. Uh, actually, all of these programs so far are taught in English, uh, but when you're studying medicine in a country, you will need to learn the local languages as well so that you're able to do practical experience uh, when you're learning about it. Because as a doctor, the practical is very important and you definitely need to uh, communicate with patients when you're working and you're doing training. So if you're not willing to learn a new language, then it's important to choose a destination where the local language is English, such as Philippines. Uh, but if you're willing to learn a language, then you can look at another option. So Malaysia is an also a great destination to study in. So there are 32 medical schools and uh, you can study in English. And this is a little bit more expensive than the schools that I've introduced before, such as China, Philippines, Kazakhstan. And so the average tuition is from around 20,000 uh, or about 12,000 US dollars to about 30,000 US dollars. And the living expenses is also fairly affordable in Malaysia. So this is an attractive place to study. And uh, I'm also going to introduce some destinations in, in Europe such as the studying MBBS in Poland. So in Poland, the living expenses are going to be cheaper than in other places in Europe. Uh, and the tuition for studying MBBS is between 9,000 to 15,000 per year. And so you can see some of the uh, programs here, such as Warsaw, the, some of the schools here, such as Warsaw Medical Academy, uh, Medical University of Gdansk, and some of the other M medical schools in Poland. And Germany is also a very attractive place to study. Uh, you do need to study in German uh, if you're studying in Germany. Uh, and so if you don't have a good enough German language ability before you study, you will need to take a one year course before that program. And so th there's free tuition for the program and it's normally six years and three months is the program, uh, but you do need to cover the living expenses, which is going to be more expensive. Uh, one advantage is you can actually work part time when you're after the second year when you're in Germany. And so if you're not sure about if you want to learn uh, German and to study in Germany, uh, it's, you, it's also important to realize that if you're going to study in Kazakhstan or Kyrgyzstan or Poland, you're probably going to need to learn the local language as well. So it may actually be uh, not too much of a problem if you're studying medicine to learn German. And so some of the top programs that you can study such as the universities are Heidelberg University, University of Munich, and you can also check out a lot more on Global Admissions Platform. So also I'm going to introduce a bit more about uh, studying in UK, which is one of the popular uh, destinations in the world to study, and I'm going to introduce more about UK a bit later. So the price of studying at UK is more expensive than a lot of the other destinations that I've introduced before. So it can be from about 23,000 US dollars per year to 60,000 US dollars. And when you're living in the UK as well, you also need to cover extra additional expenses. And so the program is uh, between five or six years, normally five years. And then after that program, you'll do two year foundation. And so it's uh, also, it's actually a similar length to other countries that I've mentioned before. Uh, one of the advantages of studying in the UK is that there's a very high compared to other countries is very high doctor salary in UK. So when you're graduating, you can start off at 40,000 pounds. And uh, after a few years, when you've been training, after training, you, the salary can range from, uh, say from $60,000 to $300,000 per year if you're becoming more specialized. So you can see that the tuition in UK is more expensive, uh, but actually the doctor salary, if you continue working in UK is a lot higher as well. Uh, so this is also something to think about and I'll introduce more about UK in a bit as well. And so you can check out more on uh, global admissions about medical destinations and studying MBBS. And uh, we're aware that lots of students have challenges right now because they are studying in one uh, location and they're looking to try to study in another or they're interested in transferring. So we also have a university transfer service 
and you can check it out on Global Admissions so we can help you a bit more then. And if you have any questions about studying in MBBS, do let me know in the comments and I can also introduce some other destinations in the future. Uh, we um, So thank you for listening guys. And